Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl now. Welcome to or welcome back to my YouTube channel. In tonight's video, I'm about to get myself prepared for the new year and I decided that instead of just doing my vision board by myself, how I normally do, I'm going to film it and share with you guys exactly how it is that I actually plan out my year and visualize it. Let's get visual. Let's make a beautiful vision board and let's manifest the best year yet, okay? There's going to be two different ways that I'm going to share with you guys of me making my vision board. First way, I'm going to do it via my computer, which I'm going to use an app and then make my vision board online digitally and then save it to my computer, either print it out or put it on my laptop background screen. And then the second way is I'm going to use my phone because what better way to have a vision board than to place it right on your phone wallpaper so that you can see it every single time you unlock your phone. So I'm going to share with you guys both ways that I'm going to make my vision board and then kind of break down exactly what it is that my visions are and what my goals are and then hopefully we can get like a little bit of inspiration, motivation and let's just get into preparing for the new year because it is December, it's Wednesday, December 28th and January 1st is right around the corner so I just want to make sure that I have all the goals that I've written down, I want to have them visualized so that I can have a visual reminder and something pretty to look at when it is that I'm thinking about getting all these goals accomplished because we got this is going to be a year this is going to be my year okay it's my year it's my year okay don't forget to go ahead and smash that like button subscribe to the channel and then comment down below if you guys are also making a vision board this year and then hopefully you guys can join the boss babe group chat and we can share our vision boards and kind of get like some discussions going so let's jump right into this video like i said in my journal with me um plan my goals for next year video anytime i'm doing something where um using my manifestations or trying to learn anything like that. I definitely like to light a candle and then I like to burn my Palo Santos or an incense and like kind of set the mood for what it is I'm about to do because it's nothing like having a clean space or a clean environment to have a clear mind. I always say clean space, clear mind. So I'm going to light my candle and then burn my Palo Santos, get my crystal set up and then we're going to jump right into vision board planning. Since I'm going to be doing this on my laptop first, I'm going to um, do like a screen recording and you guys can kind of just watch me do it like that. Uh, first thing I'm going to do, y'all, is obviously you have to go to Pinterest, okay? What is a good vision board if you're not on Pinterest? The best thing for me to actually like start getting my goals visualized is to go to some of my Pinterest folders or like look on Pinterest for inspirational pictures. So. Let's go ahead and gather some images. The first thing that I know I want is I need something with my fitness goals, okay? Like my yoga, stretching, meditation. So I'm going to look up yoga poses and then try to like find a good picture that's going to match the vibe that I'm going for. I actually want to do more yoga outside, honestly. So let's see if I can find someone doing yoga outside. This is cute. Okay, I like her outfit. She got her hair. So we'll save this. And now another goal of mine is to do more journaling. So I'm gonna look up like some of the I need to spend more time writing in my books, which I always keep right here. I always keep like some notebooks right next to me because I'm always writing something down whether it's journaling, planning, anything, drawing, I'm always writing. So let's look for a good aesthetic. I like that. I need to up my wardrobe and spend more time like shopping. Alright, so this is just organization, having my wardrobe look cohesive like I want to be able to go to my closet, have different colors, organized. I'm just, I don't know, my Virgo soul needs that type of organization. So I'm going to save this one. Okay, next, I want to spend more time meditating. And then I want to get some quotes. I really like to have like quotes on my vision board. Okay, 
so now that I found all the pictures that I think I'm going to use on my vision board, I'm going over to Canva. You want to go to desktop wallpaper as a template. So I'll just type in desktop wallpaper and then that size file should come up. And then the next thing I have to do is like upload all of my pictures that I downloaded. Okay, the next thing that I'm going to want to do after I get all my pictures uploaded or while they're uploading, go to the elements tab and then type in, either you can do like Polaroid style, I like Polaroid style, or just do link photograph. And then I see that I got photos, so I'm going to scroll, see which one I like. Actually, this first one right here might work. So basically what you're going to do is take this blank photograph and I'm just going to place it all over your canvas in different sizes. So I'm going to duplicate this a couple times and then just like make thing, make your own collage basically. So I'm going to get some. And the dope thing about Canva is that you can like layer stuff. So this position button you can go forward or backward and like place things on top of it. So it's like that overlapping effect. But yeah, I'm going to just go ahead and make my little collage how I think it should look. And then we're going to start to like drag and put all these pictures into the blank photographs. And you're going to end up playing around with this a bunch of times, to be honest with you guys. Um, when I do my vision boards, I end up like messing with it for a long time. Because I'm very, very particular. And because this is what's going to help me to manifest throughout my year, I want it to look and be very um not only aesthetic but i want it to be something that is it makes sense you know what i mean okay so i think i got like a setup that i like and i got my pictures uploaded so basically what you're going to end up doing is like taking your pictures from up on your uploads side of the canva and you basically drag it to whichever blank photograph you like. And here's how you can arrange your um, vision board very simply, okay? So I can also like drag the images if they're not fitting the way I like them to. And this is a very simple way to do um, any type of collage, but Specifically for vision boards, I like this method. Okay, I got um, a picture of so many. I'm going to explain everything that I'm putting on mine because so far, I feel like I'm capturing exactly what it is that I want my year to be. Um, hmm, like I said, you're going to end up playing around with the design, making things fit the way you want them to. And that's the thing I love about making a vision board. It's, it's a time to be creative with your vision, creative with your goals. Like, come on. Okay, I think, which other one? I think I got one more. Didn't get my love up there, let's see. Yep, so. That over here. Um, oh, one more thing. So say for instance, I want to use this picture, right? But I don't like the way that it looks on my collage. You can go to edit image. If you have Canva Pro, this is, keep in mind, if you have Canva Pro, you can actually remove the background images and like overlay them on top of stuff. So sometimes instead of having like a flat collage, I like to overlay different images on top and it gives kind of like a more I guess dynamic I guess that's a good word but so I'm going to scroll down and put this like glowing effect around it so that it pops off of the vision board change the background color to white and so see I could do something like this and then I could replace the picture that I have right here with something else like this one okay so here is another way 
to like add some, I don't know, like add some texture and depth to your vision board in case you don't want it to look super flat. But another thing that you could do is like add a text box on top and then you could write, um, like write the year and put that over top of it. Change the font to something cute. Okay, and this is just if you want to. You don't have to do this, but um, I probably will put it somewhere right in the middle like that, and then get an effect going like a neon. Change the color to to pink. Okay, so, alright, and that is how you can make a vision board for your desktop or for anything that you're trying to do with this vision board, simply using Canva. So now that I'm done, I'm going to go ahead and download this, and then I'm going to show you guys how I place this as my background on my computer. It's going to look really cute. I love it. Um, keep in mind, I'm probably going to go ahead and tweak my vision board off camera, but I'm just sharing with you guys how you can make it. and showing y'all some of the things that I probably will include. Alright, so I'm setting this picture as my desktop background and there we go. Oh, so perfect. Okay, now I'm going to have to delete all of this stuff. Alright, so basically you can see my desktop background after I delete all of this nonsense. That is on my desktop. This is a perfect time to like start clearing off your desktops, your phone, all of that stuff because the new year we do not want to keep clutter. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and delete all of this. But this is basically going to be my vision board on my background of my computer. Okay guys, so we're back in Canva. Now you want to um since we've already saved this, we can go back to the home and you can type in um, iPhone wallpaper. Okay, so once you type in iPhone wallpaper, that's going to bring up a bunch of different templates. I'm probably not going to use a template because I want to actually put my vision board on here. But you can just click whichever one you see and click customize. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and delete everything off of this. Because we don't want any of that. We just need a blank canvas. And now I'm going to upload my vision board into Canva. And keep you also can redo this the same steps that you did with the desktop. You can take those blank photographs, paste them into your phone wallpaper, drag your pictures over. But if you wanted to do a simpler version, you also could just drag this into the background and then select a part of it and then that would be like your vision board and then if you want to you can come back and like change it throughout the year so that you're looking at different parts of your vision board so say for the first half of your year you want it to be focusing on reading more exuding goddess energy um, like i say reading organizing your wardrobe more divination and painting then this section of your vision board will be your wallpaper and then you can drag it over and this section can be the um entire background for your vision board but like I said there's another way to do this which is just doing what we did for the desktop just using your iPhone here's my background right now look at my curl alright so I'm setting it as my wallpaper right now and I think I'm gonna like add some widgets and stuff on my background but for now I'm just gonna click done and here is the new vision board wallpaper. That is how you can make your vision board very easily and get ready to manifest everything that it is that you see for your life in 2023. If you guys did enjoy this video, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Let me know down below in the comments if you guys are making a vision board this year. Also, if you're interested, you can click the link down below in the description box and join the Boss Babe group chat. And we're going to be like sharing our vision boards, talking about our goals 
and just like bouncing ideas off of each other and getting feedback on what we think our vision is for the next year. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Love you guys. See you in the next one. Peace. Oh, 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 o